Hello guys, let's welcome back to the classes. So today we'll discuss the types of the plant tissue culture. Yesterday I have discussed the plant tissue. What is plant tissue? Definition and all. So the plant tissue culture types, it depends on explant. What you are using as an explant. For example, if you are using the callus, if you are, then it will come under the callus culture. If you, if you are using the uh, embryo, anther, uh, ovary or protoplast, whatever it is. So depends upon the explant, these are types of the uh, plant tissue culture. So let's discuss the first one is the callus culture callus is what callus is unorganized mass of plant cell it means there is no differentiation there is no different part of the root shoot fruit flat etc so from the callus if any single plant complete whole plant is getting generated that will comes under the callus culture next one is the embryo culture so the embryo culture means here we are taking the embryo as a explant why we are going for the embryo culture we are going for the seeds that having the premature sterile condition or that is gone under the dormant condition then we are going for the embryo culture like the seeds dormant seeds anther is what anther culture anther is the male reproductive part of the flower so uh, anther having the pollen grains and anther culture is specially used for the haploid plants for the haploid plants means we need the haploid plants then we are going for the anther culture Meristem. Meristem is the part of the plant shoot. It is present here at the tip. Meristem culture. Meristem culture is a use for the virus free plant. If we need the virus free plant, we are going for the meristem culture. Next one is the seed. So in the seed culture, we are using here seed as a explant. If we are using the seed as an explant, then it will come under seed culture. Next is the ovary culture. So ovary is the female reproductive part of the flower. So again, ovary culture is needed for the if we need the haploid plants. If we need the haploid plants, means where the chromosome number is n, then we go for the ovary culture. Next is the protoplast culture. Protoplast is having the all the cell components except the cell wall. There is no cell wall. So the protoplast, a uh, protoplast fusion is a term where we are fusing the two different protoplasts from two different plant species. So protoplast culture is also used and also it is a type of plant tissue culture, important type it is. And next is the organogenesis. Organogenesis means the uh, complete formation of organs from the callus. Means you can say that organogenesis is having the two types, first direct and another is the indirect organogenesis. So these are the different types. Uh, one more thing is important. So for all the uh, different, different uh, cultures we need the different nutrient media according to the need we are using that media so guys if you like the classes you can uh, share the classes also and we will meet with the another topic in the next video thank you